Hi everyone, let's go to one more video in our diecast channel. On this video I'm going to show you some more of my 1-64 to diecast cars made by Auto World. I'm going to focus on some Mopar models, Challengers, Darts, and Polaris. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, to share my video, and to subscribe my channel. First model I'm going to show you is this 1963 Dodge Polaris. It's a very nice car. This is very well made by Auto World in the 1 to 64 scale. Let's take a look at the engine. There we go. Very nice Hemi. Let's put some light here so we can take a better look. And the interior. That's really nice. That's another one, but that's a Max Watch. It's by uh, Auto World as well. It's very rich in details with the um, standard steel wheels in the back, hub caps in the front, hood scoop, and a better and higher performance engine. Let's open the hood. There we go. So you can see the Max Watch engine. The front grille, which is very well made. Tail lights at the bottom. I really like those sort of world cars. Next one is a Dart, 1971 Dart Swinger. Probably a 383 engine. This hood is a little hard to open, but it's okay. It's made in crazy plum. Black interior. The steering wheel is very well reduced. With a dashboard we can see here. Next one is a red one. This is in a near variation of variation of colors. I've shown a green one before. It's very nice. 71 Dart Swinger. Then we go to Challengers. First one is this 1970 Challenger. Dodge logo, Emmy engine. Then we move on to 1971. I happen to have two cars of the same colors, Crazy Plum as well. Different fronts from 1970 to 1971. 1970 rear. 1971 rear end. Very nice. Another 1971, but that's in lime green. The black top, black vinyl top looks great. It's very nice. Really like those cars. 1972. It's when we have a little radical change different grill, different engine, different rear end. We have some in emission controls in the 1970s, so Challengers lost a little bit of power. And last but not least, 1972. And 1973. 72 is in my left hand, it's a gray one, and 73 is red. We can see the difference because in 1973 they had those brackets here to reinforce bumpers according to American legislation. The engine is the same. Look at the sides, they're basically the same car and the rears. You can tell 73 from 72 because of the brackets as well. So, that's going to be it. I'd like to thank you for all comments, for sharing my video, for all likes, and please don't forget to give me your likes, comments, share my video, and subscribe my channel. Stay tuned. Thank you very much.